Hi, I'm Kelvin Wen. Welcome back to the Wednesday announcements. Please follow the official Instagram account for PHS Voice Soccer for updates. The African American Society will meet every other week on Tuesday from 3.45 p.m. to 4.15 p.m. We'll meet in the basement room B3153. Snacks will be provided and all are welcome to attend. Our last December meeting will be Tuesday, December 14th. Join and remind text message group to keep up with meetings and events. Text the code at AFAMSOC to the phone number 81010. Come leave your legacy in the African American Society. It's that time of year, Panthers. The boys and girls wrestling teams are starting their fan cloth fundraising campaign. To get your Pascal Wrestling swag, go to fancloth.shopuria. That's F A N C L O T H dot shop slash E U R E A for all your wrestling fan swag needs. You may also ask a wrestler to hook you up with the shop or check out the Pascal Wrestling Twitter feed at PHS underscore wrestling underscore one. Get it now before it's too late. Our varsity girls had a great day at the Talon Tournament at Eaton High School right before Thanksgiving. Sophomore Elizabeth Dyer placed first, continuing her excellent young career. Sophomore Crystal Martinez finished third in her first ever varsity tournament. And junior Emily Royds finished second in her second ever varsity tournament. If you see these exceptional ladies in the hall, please give them a big shout out. Our JV boys had some great success in the Talon Tournament at Eaton High School. Junior Eli Renteria placed fourth. Freshman Diego Mungia placed second. Junior Ryan Tang placed third. And junior Kyler Rose placed first, dominating every opponent. These young men are off to a great start this year. Please give them a shout out when you see them in the halls. Congratulations, men. The gentlemen of Pascal Wrestling equaled the success of their lady counterparts this past weekend at the Cougar Classic Tournament in Arlington. The boys placed fifth out of 16 teams with only six wrestlers. Junior Micah Calderon placed first in his debut tournament of the season. Sophomore Luke Wilson placed first, winning his first varsity gold medal. Senior Chase Musenda placed first, winning his first gold medal of the year. If you see these gentlemen in the halls, please give them a hearty congratulations. We are so proud of our Panther wrestlers. The ladies of Pasco Wrestling had another successful tournament this past weekend at the Cougar Classic in Arlington. They placed fifth out of 17 teams with only five wrestlers. Freshman Elena Ramirez placed second in her bracket, winning her first ever medal. Sophomore Elizabeth Dyer continued to dominate and won first place for her second consecutive tournament. Sophomore Crystal Martinez also kept her medal streak alive by placing third in her second consecutive tournament. We are so proud of the hard work and dedication of these ladies. Please congratulate them if you see them around school. Go Panther Wrestling! The Pascal Chess Club meets on Thursdays from 3.45 to 4.30 p.m. in room 288. Last week for our first meeting, we had over 15 students show up. You don't have to know how to play chess. Show up and we'll teach you. If you have any questions, see Mr. Vol Volverde in room 288. My brother Keepers meets every Tuesday during all three lunches in room 288. Come join us and see all that we offer. If you have any questions, see Mr. Valverde in room 288. There will be a JOI, Junior Optimist International, meeting next Wednesday, December 15th in room 406. Pizza will be provided. Class of 2025, are you struggling with a certain class? Don't know how to study for your exams? Need attendance recovery? If you answered yes to any of these questions, Please come out to the ninth grade only study week, December 13th to 16th from 4 to 5 p.m. in the cafeteria. Boys soccer will play its first scrimmage at home against Arlington High. Games are Game times are JV White at 5, JV Purple at 6.30, and Varsity at 8. The game will be here at Pascal and admission is free. Interested in learning how to better lead, service, and empower by strengthening your leadership skills in the areas of college, career, and community leadership? Then join Journeys. If interested, stop by Ms. Jones in N300 or Ms. Solace in the Go Center during lunches Thursday, December 9th, or Tuesday, December 14th for more information. Astronomy Club will be having a meeting this week, Wednesday after school in room 185. 
We plan to be doing club photos for the yearbooks, so the more people who come, the merrier. Have a good Wednesday.